Hello everybody, today's video is going to be very very different. Before we commence with the video, I'd just like to say yes, I am all tanned up. Um, it's part of the look to just, you know, look dirty, look like you've been shot, as you can probably see in the thumbnail. So it is a very interesting um, look that I've done. So if you are going out for Halloween, this is a very beginner's, not very hard at all look. Yeah, um, let's get on with the video. Here are the things that you will need for this look. So first up is fake blood. It's only pounds, so you can literally get that wherever, in any fancy dress shop. Then for the kind of smoky black eye look, I've got the Sleek Eye Divine Ultra Matte B2 Darks. And then you will need some tissue. So I've just got toilet roll and you will see as the video progresses what I'm doing with this tissue. I, mean, I can't remember what I coloured my lips in last year, um, what I used, but if not I think I just used the eyeliner. It's going to be really interesting me creating this look, but let's give it a go. <laughs> so first of all taking the sleek palette and I'm going to be taking the warm brown kind of colour and just putting that in the corner crease of my eye blending it out really nicely to kind of look like I've got you know a black eye, punched eye then taking the darker colour, well, the darkest colour, it's basically a black and just putting that in the corner and under the water eye line, just kind of intensify it and you know bring it down to blend it all in really nice. Then taking a different brush because I'm going to be using a white and putting that in the tear duct area and blending it out just to give it a nice blend. And of course you can't forget to highlight under the brows so taking the same brush just defining those brows making it, you know, making them stand out a bit more. <laughs> now for the fun part, taking some fake blood and some tissue. So all I'm going to do with the tissue is just simply rip loads off. It doesn't have to be neat at all. Kind of just, you know, break it all up and make it into a circle because you just want to look like you've been shot so a shotgun's obviously a circle shape trying to make it as not too small but not too big stick it on your forehead and then with the fake blood most fake bloods are sticky and then they will dry out so as you can see it's very sticky at the moment just blub it all over the tissue and the tissue will stick on your forehead basically one thing that I would say about this blood is that it kind of looks like it stains as you can see in my hand um, but you just give it a good scrub and it will come off. So yeah, just covering the whole tissue, making it look like you've been absolutely slaughtered. <laughs> um, and then as you'll see further on in the video, I'll be adding all sorts of colours onto it. <laughs> Feel free to add even more tissue on because it will build up the layers and make it more like, you know, you, you know, just build it up, make it look like it's actually happened. And then, of course, you want some on the kind of pectoral area, just right in the shoulder bone. Dab the blood all over it, make it stick to your shoulder. And then once that's done, you're going to take the sleek palette in the darkest colour and just dab the brush on top of the blood and the tissue. This will just look like it's been, well, some parts have been dried up. Then taking a warm, the warm brown just to kind of make it a little bit more softer so it's not too intense. Mm -hmm. 
and then taking the blood I bet you all forgot about this guys you've got to do under the eye so as if you have been punched in the face pull it all under your eye like that drag it down make it look really gory you only get one time of the year to make yourself look gory guys so and then for the lips um, I just decided on taking the eyeliner it's a waterproof eyeliner so hopefully it won't you know, it'll last long if not you can just take it in your handbag and just keep topping it up wherever you go on Halloween night and that ladies and gentlemen is the finished look so yeah Thank you very much everyone for watching this video also like to say I am forever grateful for everyone continuing to support me all my friends and family are always asking me how my YouTube's going I'm just trying to do as much as I can I love making videos I love inspiring people helping people out making people feel confident so that's why I believe that everyone should just be themselves and that's why I've done YouTube really just like to say quickly, if you are new to this channel, feel free to subscribe, it's free and you might as well, if you enjoyed this video, let me know some suggestions below. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video look and I hope you've been inspired by it. Have a wonderful Halloween, don't dress up too scary to scare your neighbours away and just remember to have fun. See you all very, very soon, bye!